prior to COVID, we had a number of programs that we'd layered on top of each other in our journey. And COVID kind of shut things down and social interaction. So what we decided is to use the COVID environment to kind of reimagine coming out of COVID, how we could bring this to the world in a universal way. That, that every corner of the earth from China to India to South Carolina to Wisconsin, that just part of the things we do every day is make sure that the people we have the privilege of working with in our span of care know that they matter in thoughtful, timely, appropriate ways. So we hope to emerge with this group of global team members with the foundation for kind of a, a reimagined recognition and celebration program that can be applied in every culture, in every location, in every department in the world and will be a model for others to follow which is part of our responsibility for the people who put their trust in us so that we show that we care about them. For me, recognition is part of our caring mission that we have, our caring nature for our team members. Caring is not only caring about difficult times within their lives, and certainly we do that for our team members, but to care for someone is also to say, as you would to your children, that's great work. Let me put that up on the fridge. We, I want everybody in the house to see the great work you've done here. So this week was really about reconnecting to the practice of recognition and celebration. It's been something foundational to Barry Waymiller's culture and something that we really hold in a very unique way. I think the biggest difference for us is that um, we don't see recognition and celebration as a way to get more out of people. So I think for a lot of companies, they talk about doing it, but it's kind of a manipulation and they're looking for some return on investment. It's really just foundational to letting people know that they matter. Due to COVID, many recognition program slowed down the pace, especially the SSR program, alumni program. You should come up with a common program a common recognition program so that it can be implemented across all over the companies, all over the BW facilities throughout the world. The program we have been in the Berwimila company so far has been very much based on uh, North American experiences and uh, so, so I think this is, this is what I hope is we get a, a global uh, program uh, defined. Being here in this event has made me feel the enormity of the responsibility that culture and people development have um, in safeguarding our culture and its most important pillar of recognition and showing people we care about them and they do matter. And recognition is a massive pillar of it. We must uh, recognize people every day because they, that make them feel better and not only them, but also you. So it really means a lot for that person, but also for you, you should care about it. See, the culture here with Barry Wemler is, uh, I think our Bob Chapman really cares about the people and he encouraged people, you know, the peer-to-peer -peer recognition. When that happens, people really think that they are, they are valued and they feel respected. I uh, received some recognition in the past and uh, I felt speechless because I didn't imagine that I really um, count like that. That people thought that of me. I'm kind of a not so self-confident person and those recognition really helped me a lot. And what I, I will try to do is to explain that also to my colleagues and to bring that power back to PCMC Luca too, yeah. That's the type of celebration that we want to have for team members and really say, we appreciate you, what you do, the way in which you do it, and make sure that we connect that to, it's not just about what you do, but it's about who you are. We're not recreating the wheel. Um, the things that we want to do and move forward with are already in our foundational elements of our culture of recognition. It's just the way that we refresh that, bring it back to light, um, enhance it, and then communicate it out the path forward. Really for us, um, we're leaving here with a lot of energy, and so we have to kind of pull the reins back and step back, create a good plan for implementation, and launch in the right way um, so that we can really make a difference.